probably Dr. Kruger. Uh, I've kind of, she was my research research mentor. I took her for probably most of the classes I had, and uh, I feel like she really made me think about new things that I hadn't thought of before. I want to model that in my, or you know, I want to take that and put it in my own class. I would like to uh, show those things to you know, of the students that I'll have. I want to show them how to do research and things like that, that she showed me how to do. And I actually started uh, a class, Constitutional Law, with uh, Dr. Hans Hawker. He took interest in my writing, took interest in my arguments in class, and he pulled me aside. He said, hey, we have a moot court program. I want you to be a part of that. That was the trigger of, I can do this. I still have time to go back to school. I still have time to go to law school. This is who I am, and um, this is who I was designed to be. Dr. Kemp has been just instrumental over the past few years at helping me grow as a professional individual, um, allowing me to do research, uh, pushing me in the areas that I needed to be pushed in to expand and allow me to grow, and, and also just with the technical, you know, technical growth of understanding these concepts at this at this level is just. It's amazing to be able to have that opportunity. I, I just wanted to say thank you to Dr. Purcell, you know, and the program because, you know, the CDP and all the training that I've gotten so far has been great. But without, you know, that initial, you know, going into this program, none of the other things would have happened. I, I hate to pick favorites because they are all absolutely wonderful, but she is such a great leader, um, such an inspiration to, um, to me and to young people, of older people, all ages, you know, just a great inspiration of what you can do. For instance, Dr. Hunt, he just amazed me how he, he knows you on a first name basis. He knows, he, I mean, he, he can meet you one time, two, and he knows you. And, you know, that, to me that means something. That means that I'm not just a number, that, you know, I, I, I matter. And Dr. Finnegan and Dr. Dean and Dr. Adams really helped me see that doing research could be fun and interesting, and it was all about thinking systematically and critically, and it didn't have to be this big, scary thing. So they taught me that here, and now that's what I do every day of my job. You know, I went with electrical engineering because I really like the professors. I love Dr. Mixon. He's a great teacher. Uh, he was my advisor for engineering. He just has such an enthusiasm for what he does. He loves teaching. He loves building relationships with students. I mean, I ate the other day with him. He's just a very relational person. He's incredibly intelligent, uh, but he also has, he, he's very great at relaying his knowledge over to the students. He doesn't put it too far above your head, but he helps you to really grasp uh, the information.